Climate change is a major challenge for present and future generations. The European Union, and thus Germany too, wants to become greenhouse gas neutral by 2050 to protect the climate. Therefore, greenhouse gas emissions must fall considerably. This is already happening at the European level through the European Emissions Trading Scheme. Emissions trading puts a price on greenhouse gas emissions from power plants, industrial facilities and aviation. As a complement, Germany started a national emissions trading system in 2021. The German Emissions Trading Authority at the German Environment Agency is responsible for its implementation. The national emissions trading system covers motive fuels and heating fuels whose combustion produces climate-damaging CO2 emissions. Such fuels are petrol, diesel, heating oil, liquefied gas, natural gas and, from 2023, coal. National emissions trading makes it attractive for citizens and businesses to reduce their heating fuel and motive fuel consumption. However, they do not participate directly. Instead, the fuel distributors, for example gas suppliers or companies in the mineral oil industry, are obliged to participate. A distributor must acquire and surrender a relevant certificate for each tonne of CO2 that may be emitted by the combustion of a fuel. This puts a price on the CO2 emitted. The certificates of the National Emissions Trading System will initially be sold at fixed prices, from €25 Euros in 2021, rising to €55 Euros in 2025. There will be a switch to auctions after this transition phase, and the price will then be created by the auction market. The rising certificate prices are passed on from the distributors to the fuel consumers. For example, a refinery supplies a petrol station with diesel fuel, thus placing the fuel on the market. The refinery must purchase emissions allowances for each tonne of CO2 that may be released when the diesel is burned, and the costs are passed on to the petrol station operator. The latter, in turn, passes the cost on to its customers. The more expensive diesel fuel becomes, the more attractive for customers to reduce their consumption. For example, by driving in a fuel-efficient manner, carpooling, or using a bicycle or public transport. This effect of national emissions trading is evident for all fuels covered. As a result, it is worthwhile for citizens and businesses to reduce their consumption and save energy. The use of renewable energy and climate-friendly technologies such as electromobility, solar thermal energy and heat pumps becomes more attractive. Thus, national emissions trading reduces greenhouse gas emissions and enhances climate protection.